So, uh, let me introduce myself. Uh, my name is uh, Usman Bhatt and I have uh, done my PhD in experimental aerodynamics from uh, University of Cottbus in Germany. So, I came back to Pakistan after working uh, in some couple of universities and uh, um, energy and aerospace companies back to Pakistan in about 2015. And I have always been fascinated by um, the gas turbines, by the, this, this amazing technology which was actually developed about more than 50 years ago in about 1940s. And I, it was my actually dream to build this kind of machines um, by ourselves, which are actually not available in the third world world countries like Pakistan um, or, or, or other places. So we initiated a project and that was that we s try to build a gas turbine using the commonly available components. So what comes first of all in your mind is that uh, an automobile turbocharger. Automobile turbocharger is a device that uh, has been used uh, for more than a century actually now. Um, to enhance the performance of normal car engines. But it actually resembles a gas turbine, which is very complex technology used in the propulsion of aircrafts and the power generation. So it resembles actually a gas turbine in a lot of ways. And that is a gas turbine consists of um, a compressor, a turbine and a combustion chamber. So if you note, a turbocharger has both the components and only a single component is missing there. So if we could design and build a combustion chamber um, so and couple it to, to my turbocharger, so we have actually a simple turbojet, a simple micro gas turbine, a working micro gas turbine. So we initiated a project which was supported by the University of Lahore. They um, gave us a grant, about, grant of uh, about 300,000 rupees. So we started this. I started working with my uh, students. They helped me a lot. So what we did, we first of all uh, designed a combustion chamber and did our um, first experiments on this very basic uh, uh, machine. So it took actually a lot of time to get to the point or to, to get to get to that design which could actually work. So um, fortunately, we have successfully built uh, a small micro gas turbine which can serve uh, two purposes that can be used for uh, propulsion in small drones and uh, can be also used for power generation in aircraft auxiliary units and of course many more. So we shall of course show you that model. We can also ex show you uh, the execution and how it uh, runs. Let me introduce you our newly built micro gas turbine which is built using an automobile turbocharger. So an automobile, automobile turbocharger as everybody knows is used to enhance the performance of normal car engines but it is actually very similar to a gas turbine. It has two components, the turbocharger has got a compressor and a turbine. So if I, if I try to compare it with a gas turbine, so there is only one thing missing, this is combustion chamber. So what we have done, that we have used an automobile turbocharger and built a suitably designed combustion chamber. So with all these three components, we have actually a functional micro gas turbine. So this is what that is built. The compressor that compresses the air, sends it into the combustion chamber. It is mixed with the fuel. It is being ignited and this high temperature and high pressure gases goes into the turbine. So a complete cycle is completed. So we have got a basic micro gas turbine. So it can serve two purposes depending upon what application I need. It can serve for propulsion. That means if I take a converging nozzle, I connect this gas turbine at this section to this converging nozzle, these hot gases at very high pressure could produce an enormous thrust in the opposite direction as in the aircrafts or uh, the jet aircrafts. And the second purpose, because these exhaust gases have got enough energy and pressure, this can be used also for generating power, for generating electricity. This is what is being done here. We have coupled a secondary turbine to the exhaust of this micro gas turbine. And this 
secondary turbine can be coupled uh, to an electrical generator. So roughly, this machine, if coupled to a suitably designed uh, electrical generator, would produce about 3 to 5 kilowatts of electricity.